What's up, JK4 fam? And we back with another video on there. It is a little different because Kiara is not with me right now. She in the back of the trailer getting her workout in, which I I should be with her, but I uh, got some business to handle right now. I'm gonna I'm show y'all in a second what we got going on. I'm gonna explain to y'all why I got this GoPro on my head. And I hope y'all having a wonderful day. Uh, if you're new to the channel, make sure you subscribe, uh, like, turn the, com uh, turn the post notification, and comment throughout the video. So right now we're dealing with, uh, if you can tell by the title of the video, we failed our DOT inspection uh, yesterday. And, uh, luckily, we got here at a good time. He was able to uh, spot out some stuff that's wrong with our truck, which some of y'all already knew what was wrong with it. Most, if you've been watching this, you already know. Uh, I'm explaining everything, and I'm gonna show y'all what we got fit so far. Yesterday, we got our DOT inspection. We pulled into the bay. The guy did everything, and he told us, he said, so I'm gonna have to fail y'all for y'all DOT inspection because one, we had a bad tire, and two, we had a crack in our windshield that was over I think he said one or two inches. I can't remember. Uh, I don't know what to pay back right now. But uh, we did get a new tire placement. Uh, I should have got some video clip on that, but I forgot. The guy came out yesterday and fixed that. Now, today, we had to get our windshield replaced. We're getting that replaced right now. Currently, as we speak, it's just a hold up right now. I'm going to show y'all everything, but it's a hold up right now because the company that came to put our windshield on, they had the right windshield that was in the process of putting it on, and one of the guys cracked his side of the windshield. How? I don't know. I don't know if it was the suction cup that he was using, or uh, I don't know what it was, because before they put the windshield on, I looked at it, I saw them putting it on, and there wasn't no crack. But I think it was the suction cup that he had used or whatever. So, this is what we're doing right now. Uh, this is currently waiting. They sent two vans uh, to put the glass on. One of the vans went back to the company to get a new glass. So, while we sit right here, wait on him, what I'm gonna do is uh, I'm gonna go show y'all the brand new tire we just got. I'm gonna show y'all our other tires. Like we told y'all the other day, our tires that we got on our trailer right now, we need more, we need some more. Um, we're gonna get them replaced, probably next reset. Hopefully we'll be at a gas station and we can get, a, get them replaced next reset and get an alignment on our truck. But I'm gonna get out, I'm gonna show y'all the tires that we, the tire that we got replaced yesterday. And I'm gonna use the GoPro with that. That's why I got the GoPro on. And then uh, when they get back and start replacing the glass on the truck, I'm gonna record some more of that, show y'all that they 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 doing they they doing their thing, they doing their thing. I'm also gonna walk back there and let y'all speak to Kiara. She gonna probably be mad because she don't like not bother her while she work out. All right, y'all. So this the tire right here. We go get we, we got replaced yesterday. Y'all can see brand new. We haven't even drove on it yet. Uh, the guy came right here yesterday and placed everything. He had enough room to you know do his do his work. Uh, the time we did have on here, I didn't get a picture or a video of it because the, the guy did it so quick and I was just, you know, caught in the moment. But uh, we're gonna get all these tires replaced before this side get bad. Y'all can see, if y'all can see from the side, like it's a whole difference. This side over here look just like that side over there. So yeah, we'll get it replaced. And uh, let me just show y'all the windshield right now because we currently, like I said, we waiting on the windshield to come to me. Ain't no windshield up here right now. The side that did get cracked crack was on this side right here. And uh, I think the suction cup right here would made that side crack. I think I might be wrong. But let's go back in and check on Kiara, see what she's doing. I was gonna use the GoPro, but it went dead on it, so we we'll have to use that another day. I might put it on charge and finish up this video whenever they fix me the glass. All right, y'all, Kiara back here getting her workout in. Got her weights right there, her jump rope. So yeah, while she do, while she do that, I'm gonna be handling the biz. Let me take this off because it went dead, but I'm gonna be handling the biz up here. Uh, waiting for them to get our windshield finished, and now uh, we're gonna hit the road today. And I think she do got us a load booked up already. Uh, I can get in and confirm that hopefully they don't take too long on our windshield that, to the point that they have to remove our load. Uh, let me see what we got going on right now today for our loads. I'm a little thirsty, y'all. Currently, we are let's see, let's see, let's see, let's see. Let's see, let's see. And y'all, this tablet that we got, the new tablet that we got, we told y'all we had to replace. Oh, well, we didn't have to replace it. We, uh, I broke the charger. I remember that video, if you didn't, it's about two videos back. I broke the charger. I went in there and the guy was like, we don't need to use these tablets no more. I don't know why they Snyder didn't update us and tell us that they got a new uh, tablet. But uh, we got the newer tablet now. It's working fine. The GPS did mess up here and there, but it's way better, faster than the last tablet that we had. But so far, she got us a load picking up at Bard. INCCR bar, whatever that is. It's in Covington, Georgia. We're going to Carlisle, Pennsylvania to the Snyder OC. If you know, you know. If you don't, you don't. I love the OC. Nice OC. 
clean. I always look good up there. The load got to be picked up at 2 o'clock. Whoa, 14, 12, 13, 14. 2 o'clock. The load got to be picked up at 2 o'clock, and that's two hours from now. So hopefully uh, this don't mess us up. Come on, I just thought about that. We might have to send a message and see if we can get an extension on that. Because, like I say, he gone. He had to go back and get a, another glass because he cracked the first one. Mm -mm -mm. Two o'clock. I just thought about that. It, it's 12 o'clock now. And I think we got to sit like an hour or 45 minutes before we can drive with the new with the new windshield wipe along. I guess we'll have to wait to see right now. All right, my bad. I tried to get when they was pulling up or whatever. But they're finally back. They got the brand new windshield in. They put the windshield in right now as we speak. Uh, this guy on this side right here is the one who cracked it. Not saying it was, you know, somebody did on purpose with them, but he cracked on his side. I don't know how, but they came back. He came back with a new windshield. So right now, we're getting that installed in. All right, y'all, I think they finished with the windshield. Everything's good to go. They're cleaning it up right now. All right, y'all, so they finally finished with the fresh glass on our truck. Everything look good. The only problem that I think we're going to have is I got to, we got to get an inspection anyway before we can make it out the gate anyway. Now I explained a little bit of the board that in a minute. But I got to make sure this in the right spot and I got to make sure the camera in the right spot. With. And this the inside. Nice and clean, nice and clean, nice and clean, nice and clean. Another problem too, I got to make sure, I don't know. Got to get, get, try to get this stick back up here. I know it goes somewhere right beside the camera. I don't know if it's up high. I'm gonna try it right there and just leave it right there. Uh, see, it ain't sticking, so I gotta get some more. Uh, probably some double sided tape to go right there. Okay, so with the whole inspe <clears throat> inspection thing is, uh, by rule, we gotta get an inspection on our truck every three months uh it was time for an inspection take these off it was time for an inspection we got our inspection did and they noticed that we did need a new tire and we needed a new windshield so they put us out of service for that uh, once they put us out of service we cannot leave out of snotter yard without getting that stuff fixed before we leave we cannot leave they will not let you leave they don't care if you know somebody who can put tires on they don't care if you know somebody who can put windshields on you gotta have you gotta get this stuff fixed before you can leave out the yard so that's what we had to do because, like I said, we failed the uh, inspection. So with that being said is, now that the inspection, now that the windshield is fixed and the tire is fixed, uh, we gotta go back through the inspection again. It's not gonna be a whole inspection, it's just gonna be the inspection. The inspection gonna be on the parts that we did fail on, so it won't take long. They gonna look at the windshield and see that it's fixed. They gonna look at the tire and see that it's fixed. And uh, we should be good to go after that. It was, I think it was perfect timing that we did it during our reset. Because uh, if it would have been like in the middle of the week, we got that special with some loads on us, they would have, I'm pretty sure they would have canceled the rest of our loads and we would have been out of luck. All right, so another thing is too though, we have had multiple inspections since our window been cracked. Now we did have, we had a total of three cracks on our windshield. We had two real small ones like we told y'all and showed y'all like that long. And we had that one long one that I'm gonna post right here that y'all see. Um, we, uh, so the people who did our inspection, they didn't put us out of service. I guess everything was good. Yeah, well, it wasn't good, but they just didn't decide to mark it down, which, you know, I don't know if that was a good thing or a bad thing. This guy, he did his job. He did what he was supposed to do. Uh, he made us realize that we need to take care of that business, which we decided to do this week. Luckily, it was a good thing that we was on a reset and got everything done. Uh, Kiara finna go take her shower and then uh, gotta go through the special bed again, like I told y'all, and then we should be able to hit the road. Right now it is 12.56, so by the time she get out here, there, we might be a little late to our pickup load. Like I said, we gotta pick it up about two o'clock and it's in Covington, Georgia. I think it's like 30 minutes from here. So it might be a little late, but better late than never. All right, y'all, so Kiara in the bay right now. Kiara, say what's up. Uh, they doing our inspection as we speak. I think they doing it, or they got the detailing right now, I don't know. Um, everything should be good though, we finna see. But check out that window though. It don't even look like a window in there. Whew. Gotta clean them up. Kier. Kier hanging on me. I don't think about the still. We still gotta make sure we get make sure this put up here right. And I think that's good over there. You said what, baby? 
Keep our distance on these dump trucks. Oh yeah, keep we gonna keep our distance on dump trucks and uh, not the dump trucks, the uh, rock rock truck. Them. Yeah, yeah, that's that, that, that dump truck. I think about the trash truck. My bad. Yeah, gonna keep our distance on these dump trucks, even though it might be a rock in the road and the car can shoot there too. But them dump trucks, they be dropping rocks and the rock be bouncing and stuff.